Have you ever wondered what introverts really love but rarely talk about? It's not what most people think. In our current world where everyone values loud voices and constant interaction, introverts have their own secret joys that might surprise you. In this video, I will unveil 10 things introverts secretly enjoy that most people overlook. Trust me, it's not what you think. It doesn't really matter if you're an introvert looking to feel understood or just curious about what makes introverts silently happy. You're about to gain a whole new perspective. By the end of this video, you'll not only understand introverts better, you might even discover something new about yourself. So stick around because what you learn next might change how you see introverts forever. Now let's get started. Number one, when plans are canceled. There's an unspoken joy that introverts feel when a planned social event gets canceled. You know that feeling when you've mentally prepared yourself to go out, but deep down, you've been hoping for some excuse to stay home instead? That's the introvert's dream. When plans get canceled last minute, it's like a get out of jail free card. No need to dress up, no awkward small talk, no social energy required. But here's the thing, introverts aren't antisocial. They enjoy hanging out with friends and family, but those social activities tend to drain their energy. So when plans fall through, it's not about disliking the people they would have seen. It's about embracing the gift of unexpected free time to recharge. Whether it's curling up with a good book, indulging in a favorite hobby, or simply enjoying the peace and quiet, introverts savor these moments of solitude. It's the perfect excuse to take a break from the world without feeling guilty about it. Number two, long solo walks. For an introvert, a long solo walk is more than just a way to get some exercise. It's an essential part of their self-care routine. There's a certain tranquility that comes with wandering through nature or quiet streets, where they can let their mind roam freely. The world moves at its own pace, and there's no rush to keep up. These walks offer a break from the overstimulation that often comes with daily life. It's a chance to think, to process the events of the day, or to daydream. It's like pressing the reset button on their mental state. While walking, they can listen to their favorite podcast, lose themselves in the sounds of birds chirping, or simply enjoy the stillness. This quiet time is sacred. It helps introverts find clarity and recharge their emotional batteries. They don't have to worry about talking to anyone. They can just be, which is exactly what they need to regain balance in a world that can sometimes feel too loud. Number three, having the house to themselves. Picture this, the house is empty. There's no noise, no interruptions, just pure, uninterrupted bliss. For an introvert, having the house all to themselves is a rare and precious gift. It's not that they don't love their family, roommates, or significant others. It's that they crave moments where they can completely let go and relax without worrying about anyone else's needs. When the house is quiet and still, introverts can indulge in their personal routines. Whether it's reading, watching a favorite show, or simply lying on the couch, the freedom to do whatever they want without feeling judged is incredibly freeing. There's no one around to question their habits or pull them into conversation. These moments are important for introverts because they allow them to reset and recharge. In a busy household, it can be hard to find that mental space, but when they have the whole place to themselves, it's like a sanctuary. Number four, a quiet space to retreat to. For introverts, having a quiet space to retreat to isn't just a preference, it's a necessity. Whether it's a cozy reading nook, a home office, or even just a favorite chair in the corner of the room, Introverts need a designated place where they can escape the noise and busyness of life. This space becomes their personal haven, where they can recharge and find balance. After a day filled with social interactions, work stress, or running errands, retreating to a peaceful corner of the house is like a breath of fresh air. This space gives them time to reflect, recharge, and think. The outside world can be overwhelming, but here, they feel safe and in control. It's also a place where they can be creative or productive on their own terms. Having this quiet refuge allows introverts to nurture their inner world, which is vital for their well-being. Number five, working from home. The ability to work from home is a dream come true for many introverts. Why? Because the workplace can often be filled with distractions, constant chatter, impromptu meetings, and the inevitable small talk at the coffee machine. For introverts, this can be draining making it harder to focus on their work. Working from home, however, 
allows introverts to create their own environment where they can work in peace. They can set up their workspace to be exactly how they like it, whether that means working in complete silence or having calming music in the background. There's no need to worry about office politics, noisy co-workers, or forced social interactions during lunch breaks. This level of control helps introverts be more productive and feel more fulfilled. And the best part? They can manage their energy better, taking breaks when needed, without the pressure to constantly engage with others. Number six, shopping online. For many introverts, shopping in busy malls filled with crowds, noise, and endless small talk is a nightmare. Navigating through busy aisles, waiting in long lines, and dealing with salespeople can make the experience feel overwhelming. That's why online shopping is a godsend for introverts. With just a few clicks, introverts can browse through endless options, compare prices, and make thoughtful purchases, all from the comfort of their own home. There's no need to rush, no pressure to buy, and definitely no awkward small talk with the cashier. They can take their time, think about their choices, and even read reviews before committing. The convenience and solitude of online shopping make it a stress-free way to get exactly what they need without stepping foot outside. Plus, the bonus? There's always the possibility of discovering something unique that they couldn't find in-store. Number 7. Meaningful Conversations Over Small Talk While introverts may not be the life of the party, they're not opposed to socializing altogether. In fact, they love conversations that go beyond the surface. Small talk about the weather or generic pleasantries can feel draining to introverts, but give them a meaningful topic and you'll see them light up. Introverts value deep, thoughtful conversations where they can connect with someone on a more personal level. Whether it's discussing a passion, exchanging ideas, or talking about life experiences, these types of interactions feed their soul. They love learning from others and sharing their own perspectives in a way that feels genuine and substantial. And because they're such good listeners, introverts often offer profound insights and carefully considered responses. These meaningful exchanges leave introverts feeling energized and understood, something that superficial small talk could never achieve. Number eight, being alone in public places. It might sound contradictory, but introverts often enjoy being alone in public. How? By blending into the background. Whether it's sitting in a cafe with a book, wandering through a park with headphones on, or working quietly in a library, introverts find comfort in being part of the hustle and bustle without having to engage with it directly. In these settings, introverts can observe the world around them without being part of it. It's a way to feel connected to the energy of a place without the pressures of interaction. They get to people watch, reflect on their thoughts, or just enjoy the environment, all while maintaining their sense of personal space. It's the best of both worlds. The energy of a public space combined with the peacefulness of solitude. Number nine, the sound of rain. There's something almost magical about the sound of rain that introverts find incredibly soothing. The gentle rhythm of raindrops tapping against the window creates a calm, cozy atmosphere that helps introverts unwind. Rainy days are like nature's way of giving them permission to stay indoors, wrapped in a blanket with a hot cup of tea or coffee. Rain provides the perfect backdrop for introverts to indulge in their favorite activities, whether it's reading, writing, or simply daydreaming. The outside world seems to quiet down during a storm, which allows introverts to focus on their inner thoughts. And the best part? It's a built-in excuse to avoid social events or going out. After all, what could be better than staying in and enjoying a peaceful, rainy day from the comfort of home? Number 10 Solo Projects Introverts tend to excel at solo projects. Whether it's writing, crafting, designing, or even problem solving, they love the freedom to work independently and create something that's entirely their own. These projects allow them to focus on their passions without any outside distractions, and they take pride in the process as much as the finished product. One of the reasons introverts love solo projects is because they can work at their own pace on their own terms. They don't have to compromise or collaborate unless they want to, which gives them a sense of control and creative freedom. Whether they're working on a personal blog, building a piece of furniture, or planning a long-term goal, these solo endeavors give introverts a deep sense of fulfillment. The act of creating something purely for themselves is incredibly satisfying and allows them to tap into their unique talents. There you have it, 
These are just a few things that introverts secretly love. While this list isn't exhaustive, it provides a glimpse into what makes introverts tick. What did you think of this list? Do any of these resonate with you? Let us know down in the comments. Now if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, subscribe, and share it with your friends. Thank you for watching, and be sure to like and subscribe because there's more incredible content on the way. Stay blessed.